Hello, it's Jason Pinto of Interlink One. I'm here with something that I really love, eggnog. But you know what? If I kept drinking a lot of eggnog every day, every hour, you know what would happen. I'd become so wide that I wouldn't even fit on the screen in the video you're watching. And when it comes to these things, QR codes, it's easy to get excited. Um, but it's sometimes what happens is we forget what happens when someone actually scans the QR code. Right? Do we try to fit our whole entire corporate website into this little screen, into just those few inches, or a landing page, or whatever it might be? Sure, we get excited, but that's such an important component to the overall success of QR codes. Simplifying what you display on someone's phone, because you want that experience to be fast, you want them to be able to easily see what you're asking and what you're providing. So that way, not only will it help them, but it will enable you to get more responses for whatever you're trying to do, whether it's marketing or education or whatever other purpose you might have been using QR codes for. So. Make sure you keep that in mind. Mobile optimize the sites that you direct people to from your QR codes. It's a lesson that I've learned. And another lesson that I've learned is that I'm going to go throw this away before I have to hit the gym like five times this, this weekend. All right, I'll see you later. Thanks a lot.